Hey guys, RBA Lou coming back at you. We got some of the guys here. And this is vlog number two. I'm gonna walk over here because they're too loud. I just wanted to update everybody on current events going on, the whole gym situation, everything. Everything's looking good. Um, the thing is, we're still waiting for the current tenant of the location that we acquired uh, to get the fuck out. <laughs> uh he hasn't long story short he hasn't like paid his bills or whatever and the business he's running doesn't match with what he signed up for so um the landlord's trying to evict him and that's a whole process and we're in covid right now so something's telling me it's not going to be a walk in the park uh hopefully it happens sooner than later because it's getting cold out but that's another story we're going to innovate on that um and i'll make a separate vlog for that all i wanted to share with you guys today is anything really that you do want is not going to come easy a lot of people ask me why don't you have a gym already and i actually tried to get one like three months ago so a really quick story on it is um me and my partner we went to go look at places and the first one we actually saw we were like this is it this is perfect it's close to home um it has everything we need ha 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 you know um, we put an offer on it, we actually signed, and we were ready to go. And of course, so the landlord that we were trying to get the place from, she goes to her dentist, and she's telling her about everything that's going on, and the dentist was like, oh, I'm looking for a spot as well. So you know what this woman does? She actually gives him the spot over us. And at the end of the day, I don't blame her, he is a doctor, but that's kind of messed up, you know? We already had everything signed. So that was place number one. Place number two um, that we were going to get was in Tenafly. Yeah, it was in Tenafly, New Jersey. Um, it was like a little bit over our budget, but it was really nice because we didn't have to do any construction to it. Had like two bathrooms, a whole mirror room, lounge area, change. It had everything. It had everything we wanted. We were like, all right, we'll, we'll make it work. Um, let's do it. Let's sign. Wow, this one sucked because my partner, you know, he couldn't make it to the meeting with me. So I had to do basically a, sh a whole Shark Tank thing with the landlord trying to explain to him what, what's RBA, what do we do, la, 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 la. And after selling him, after a whole hour and a half of my life wasting there, I left with the biggest migraine of my life out of that meeting. He kept trying to raise, like, the initial rent. Like, we told him we were going to offer him, since we're this is our first business venture, we're going to offer him, like, five months up front. Um, and he kept pushing it to six. Then in the contract, he pushed it to six and a half. And through our advisors, we just found out he wasn't a great guy. So we decided to opt out of that deal as well. And that one was a headache because I had to drive to that location more than a handful of times. But you live and you learn. So where are we now, you ask? We are at the third location. The third location um, is literally five minutes from here. It's in Little Ferry. Um, if we get this, this is going to be money because... The location is in a strip mall area and it cannot be more perfect. The landlord is like a year, two, three years older than me, so he's a really cool guy. His dad owns it, obviously, but like he's representing them and he's really young, so he like gets what we're trying to do. He's with it. He wants a gym in that location, so it just it's even better, right? But that's the current scenario with that one. The current tenant there, we got to make sure that he leaves. Um, and that we could replace it because they need to do construction on it, so on and so forth, and that's going to take some time. Mind you, it's about to be Thanksgiving tomorrow. Um, it's getting pretty cold out. I had to order a restaurant tent, just like the ones that outdoor dining have right now. Um, and I have a client that actually has a heat lamp that we're going to put up as well in there. So it'll definitely get the job done. I'm not afraid of innovating. I think um, you know it's totally doable. And I just wanted to update everyone on the current events happening here at RBA. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give me a subscribe. Um, like it, share it. You guys know the whole nine yards. I'll get better with these over time. If you watched it this far, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Hope you have a good day.